Northwestern wearing the road purples and Missouri in the yellow jerseys. Northwestern controls off the tip. This is Dave Sobolewski, one of the team captains. And a nice pick and roll and delivery to Alex Ola, seven footer, 265 pound sophomore from Romania. Left side, this is Cobb and he nails a triple. Jershon Cobb, a 35% three point shooter. That's three already here in the early goings of this first half, but a turnover and a run out opportunity. Drew Crawford, the leading active career scorer in the Big Ten Conference. That is something that officials are looking at more closely here this season. Sobolewski, great drive past the Missouri Bigs. Sobo goes into traffic. I'm really impressed with Missouri so far. They played terrific defense. They've dominated the backboard. They played with energy. Six points for Clarkson, left corner. Three ball is good out of the palm of Cobb. I mean, size matters in the game of basketball. And Missouri really dominating, dominating the side. That's a big shot for him right there. Yeah, he gets scored on at one end, and he knocks down the three at the other. Nathan Taphorn. Williams, blocked from behind by Cobb. Cobb comes out of there with it. Yeah, Nathan Taphorn's doing a great job in there at the five, just holding his ground. So Belusky the drive. Goes cross court. This is Taphorn. Got it again! The fact that Taphorn has been down there at the five, banging, and being physical with Rosberg, they just loosened him up. Five seconds on the clock. Cobb, the pull-up jumper. One second. Will Missouri get a shot off? No, they will not. And an exclamation point at the end of a first half performance that finds Northwestern up by a handful, heading into the locker rooms. Trailing by nine. Yeah, Missouri's really picked up their defensive presence. They're switching now out there in the perimeter. And that is the first make. It was atrocious up until that stiff jumper by Jershon Cobb. And that, they are dangerous. A 17-2 run for Missouri, but Demps able to cut into that a little bit. Trey Demps, the first name, fitting on that three ball. Certainly. Bad news if it's something that could possibly linger here going forward for Northwestern. Three ball from the right corner off the mark out of the palm of Ernest Ross. Yeah, how much of that was my turn, I don't know, in the sense of Ernest Ross taking that shot. I don't think Frank Haith was happy with that corner three from Ernest Ross. It led to the lead out, and sobolowski has got a chance to make it a three-point play. Heck of a finish by Dave Sobolewski. He's the active leading scorer in the Big Ten. Abrahamson can't finish. The follow up in and one. Nate Taphorn. Well, these Wildcats, they're not going away easy, that's for sure. Now Taphorn responding on penetration. It's a, it's a great time to go crash the offensive glass. Missouri rotates. Taphorn stays with the play. Ernest Ross does not get inside an established position, and he's got a chance. So not sure if anything is related to that or if it's coming back to haunt him. Kanoe's a tough kid. If he could play, he would absolutely be in there. That's just a blown assignment there by the freshman J3. The switch again up top. Here's Ola playing with four fouls. Dishes it out. Taphorn hits again. Ten to shoot. Clark going baseline, leaves it for Rosberg, lefty finish is good. So your final score, 78-67, final thoughts, coach. Good win for Frank Haith, November matters, both these teams are going to get better.